So here in California, obviously, we've been having some massive, horrendous wildfires, probably hundreds dead in the Northern California wildfires. Shelby Grad is the assistant managing editor of the LA Times. And Shelby Grad tweeted out that Jerry Brown, the governor here, who is one million years old and actually remembers the Pleistocene era, Shelby tweets out, Jerry Brown told the truth about California fires that no one wants to hear. What is that truth? That truth is there are too many people. I love that for the left, when you suck at being a governor, you just get to claim there are too many people. It's amazing. So if you're on the right, and people on the left say income inequality, you say, right, income inequality has existed in every society at every time. The only thing we should be worried about is whether the impoverished in the United States are able to grow economically. Then they say, ah, oh, you're ignoring, you're ignoring hope. You're ignoring change. They're like, well, no, inequality has existed for all of time. That's a, that's a reality. But if you're on the left and you say, yeah, a bunch of people are going to die in wildfires because there are too many humans, then they're like, good answer, good answer. Here's what Jerry Brown says. He says, you know, we've had fires for long before the Europeans showed up here and our indigenous people had a different way of living with nature. For 10,000 years, there were never more than 300,000 people living in California. Now we have 40 million and we have a totally different situation. He remembers because 10,000 years ago, Jerry Brown was there. He actually observed how many people were there. He says, so it's not one thing, it's people. It's how people live. It's where they live. It's the change in climate. And the truth is we're gonna have more difficulties. Except, as it turns out, Jerry Brown fully understands why the wildfires have gotten so bad in the state of California. You know why the wildfires have gotten so bad in the state of California? Because of state policy that stinks. Okay, back in August, he basically acknowledged as much. The Santa Cruz Sentinel reported back in August before the wildfires that Brown was proposing one of the most significant changes to the state's logging rules in nearly half a century, according to Emily Zanotti over at Daily Wire. Governor Jerry Brown is proposing broad new changes to California's logging rules that would allow landowners to cut larger trees and build temporary roads without obtaining a permit as a way to thin more forests across the state. Under Brown's proposal, private landowners would be able to cut trees up to 36 inches in diameter so long as their purpose was to thin forest or reduce fire risk. So he understood like a couple of months ago that one of the reasons these big fires were happening is because of crappy fire policy. It's not just people on the right saying this, by the way. You know, Trump tweeted out this and people were like, oh, how, how could he? How could he tweet this out? Now, he shouldn't have tweeted that he was going to withdraw fire aid. That was ridiculous. But he wasn't wrong that it is fire management policies in the state of California that have exacerbated the risk of bad fires. How do I know this? Because Mother Jones, the communist magazine, they wrote a piece back in December called A Century of Fire Suppression is why California is in flames. This piece points out that because they have not actually participated in fire suppression, meaning like controlled fires, controlled burns that get rid of a lot of the undergrowth, when fires do happen, they're basically giant conflagrations. According to experts like Sasha Berlman, who's a fire ecologist, the biggest problem here is 100 years of fire suppression that has led to a huge accumulation of fuel loads, just dead and debris from trees and plant materials in our forest and our woodlands, as a result of that, our forests and woodlands are not healthy and we're getting more catastrophic fire behavior than we would otherwise. Okay, so even Jerry Brown recognizes this, but I love that the media are basically covering for him and saying, you know what? It's not that Jerry Brown is bad at his job. It's that there are too many people living in California. He said the same thing about the, I love this. He, he did say the same thing with regard to the drought in the state of California. So it turns out we've had several tens of millions of people in California for as long as I have been alive. And we've also had drought problems in California for as long as I've been alive. We could have built all new infrastructure. We could have worked on desalination plants. We could have worked on ensuring that we weren't pumping millions of gallons of fresh water out into the San Francisco Bay in order to protect the Delta smelt. There's lots of stuff we could have done. Instead, Jerry Brown just said, there are too many people living in the state of California. I love that that's a good excuse. There are too many people. You notice how the left always comes down to that? Abortion makes the economy better because there are too many people. You know, what we really, global warming is bad because there are too many people. Okay, so which, which million people would you kill? Who you want to do? Who who you want to off here? I promise you, Jerry Brown is not interested in in killing off members of his own California constituency. I would imagine it's it's incredible what you can get away with if you happen to be on the political left.